All right, you guys, I just got home from school and we're gonna be doing some fishing today. We're gonna do a lake near me um, in a different neighborhood. And this is the um, thing we're gonna be using. It's a mystery tackle box. Um, I think I'll just show my address. I'm gonna have to blur that. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and use this and see what we can catch on it. All right, for today, we actually hired a cameraman, AKA my friend who I'm paying to record. And so, yeah, we're gonna have some better angles today, hopefully. We're at the location right now. First off, we got the sticker. This is going on one of my tackle boxes. All right, we're gonna go and pick out which lure we're starting with out of all these. All right, we're rigged up. We're gonna go ahead and start throwing. All right, you guys, so we're about to take our first cast. We're gonna go ahead and throw this in uh, right over here on this corner. All right. You guys, so earlier Nick wasn't here um, when I was showing you for this. Um, so we're gonna go more in depth now. So right here, we got a um, little swim jig. It's Guggen Squad, that is amazing. Guggen are my favorite uh, lure making company. Got a little crankbait, some soft plastics. I might switch to these right now. And obviously we had those over there, which is what I'm using now. So all right, we're gonna go ahead and switch up to um, these soft plastics instead, I'm pretty sure. All right, we just saw a bunch of fish right up in here. We're on the other side now. Um, we can go ahead and pan to it and stuff. It's really good looking. Um, yeah, we're just casting along this bank here for now. Uh, we're gonna see if we can't get something good. I've caught a few right here, just cruising a little soft plastic up and off these rocks and stuff. They seem to really like it when it pops up. And just as it's sinking down, if it's near one of their nests, they'll go ahead and smack it. And so we're just gonna mess around here for a minute and see if we can't get anything. higher up on the bank so that the fish don't see us and stuff and try to get any that might be lingering up on this bank. All right, we're right here. This is where I get the most bites in this area. So we're gonna go ahead and try this. See if we can get some right here. All right. So, we were looking at this area down here and we saw some um, graffiti down in here. We wanted to go check it out. Ooh. That water is cold. <laughs> These are waterproof when the socks aren't, so um, the water went over it. Here, if you want, you can hand your phone down and I'll be very careful when you try to get a uh, video of it in there. All right, here. All right, you guys, we're now Parker Fishing Vlogs POV. We got cameraman Nick up there. Going down into a mysterious tunnel. So I'll show you some graffiti. Probably the best uh, one I had to say is the goat one. Yeah. Like, yeah, man. Um, I think that's the only one. Yeah, besides like scribbles on the wall. Like, you know. Yeah, I might have to blur those out probably. So it's a really cool little thing right there. So yeah, um, we're gonna get back to fishing. It's really hot, so we're gonna move from that area, even though there's a lot of good fish over there, we're gonna go ahead and move because the sun is just blaring directly in our face and it is not fun. All right, we're gonna cut back to when I'm switching lures. So we got this little uh, soft plastic on right here. We're gonna go ahead and start throwing it. Um, yeah. All right, we found this area right here. It looks pretty good. Right here along the bank. It's kind of a bad cast. We're gonna go ahead and fish here for me. All right, we made it completely down the bank now. Um, we're gonna start fishing this little corner right here with this log. Uh, yeah, we're gonna see what we can get. All right, we're gonna start going. All right, y'all, we just got another bite right here. There's some people chasing their dogs up there. Yeah. Um, we are gonna try to get this guy right here. He came right up on the bank. I saw him, he was pretty decent. He looked like a three, maybe two, maybe three. But there, you know. Um. All right, let's see. 
Mystery Ooh. Tackle Box. Um, came in clutch. We done caught the large mouth. Um, yeah, he ain't large. I'll tell you that. Definitely ain't large. He didn't really even fight me at all. But um, this guy does not put the large in large mouth. I got him unhooked. This is the fish right here. Caught him on a little soft plastic, just jigging it along the bank. We were just bringing it up, letting it sit, you know, doing the average. So we're gonna go and let this guy go. Um, we're gonna act like he's giant and try to rebreathe him, you know. Gee, man tried to attack me, he wouldn't die. All right, let's go to the next fish. Recording here and he can't be shown on camera. His but he is um walking around with a lure looking like a sack of garbage so we're gonna <laughs> we're type up one of these little soft plastics you know and uh, one of these hooks from the mystery tackle box one of these hooks and just a little split shot so we're gonna go and get him rigged up and uh yeah if he catches any fish we'll go ahead and show him all right, so we went ahead and got this little thing set up with a little split shot. And so this is sadly the last cast. We got to go ahead and head out. So we're going to go ahead and show some video from the other day of me catching some bowfin down in Florida. Um, they're around 10 pounds. One of them and the other one was around six. So we're going to go ahead and show that right now. And then we're going to cut to the outro. Teeth. I don't know how the hook ended up like that. I'm going to have to get that out. Um, all right, I'm going to go ahead and get the hook out real quick. Hey y'all, we just got this fish. I don't even know what it is. Oh, jeez. We're gonna keep this guy, actually, and try to eat him. I don't know if we're supposed to eat this guy, because I don't even know what he is. But, um, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and um, dispatch it to this guy. Uh, he's got really sharp teeth, which is really cool. Um, I don't know if those are showing up well on the camera. I didn't really get video of me catching him, but he is cool, and he's big, too. I weighed him, he's about six pounds. So, yeah, he's an absolute chunk. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and dispatch of this guy. Alright. Our pole, our, my phone got knocked over. All the footage got messed up. That, this fish almost took my pole over the side when it bit. Jeez. Oh my god, it's a monster. Oh my god, it's a monster. What the heck? This thing is huge. Oh my god. Gee, this thing's like 10, 11 pounds. Alright, you guys. <laughs> this is just insane. We're keeping these two fish. We're going to fillet them up and eat them and stuff. Um, I guess they're just mystery fish. That's what I'm going to put in the title, I guess. Just tell me what you think they are in the comments or something. Uh, this is just crazy. My hands are all dirty. Just got these guys both on the stringer. Um... We're going to go and put these guys uh, in the cooler once my dad gets here and stuff. But jeez, this is crazy. Right, we just searched it up, and it turns out these guys are both in. And they're quite big ones as well. So we're going to put these guys in the cooler and bring them home for them. Got a plastic bag in there and a stringer. But we have these huge both in. And I've heard they're not too good at eating, but we're going to try our best. We're just going to fillet them up in this video, and we'll cook them in the next. So, yeah. Uh, here's the bowfin. Alright, so sadly in this video we didn't get the bowfin filleted and everything, but we'll release a video of us cooking them and stuff over the summer. Alright, that's gonna have to be it for this video. Make sure to subscribe and go check out my newest videos. I post almost daily fishing videos that are just like this one. Also, thank you so much for a thousand on Instagram.